Technology at Market General Hospital is allowing doctors to better attack brain tumors. Last June, MGH became the first hospital in the U.S. to perform a surgery using the Brain Path device to remove tumors. In tonight's Your Health Matters, TV6's Dustin Bonk met up with a recent Brain Path patient who was fully awake during the procedure. Some of the footage may be a little graphic. I was just so happy to get it over with. I just wanted them in there and get that tumor out of there. 60-year-old Robin Charleboy of Wells is diagnosed with grade 3 brain cancer. She had brain path surgery in March to remove her brain tumor, but she was the first brain path patient to be fully awake. Robin says she felt no pain during the five-hour surgery. I don't know that I even knew what it felt like. I can tell you that I was totally numb, totally numb. And I, I bet you today I could still put my thumb on spots that feel like they're numb. She recalls talking and joking during the surgery. Robin was uh, chatting away. In fact, we had to ask her to stop talking for a little bit because when you talk, uh, you know, the brain moves a little bit. Look who's Look at you. Here. Hi there. How are you? Dr. Rovin is the neurosurgeon who operated on Robin. He says the brain path device allows doctors to reach and remove tumors beneath the surface of the brain, a surgical procedure not offered before. It makes me feel like I'm fulfilling my duty to my patients which is to always provide them the best care possible. Robin's surgery went perfectly. She still receives radiation and oral chemotherapy treatments to eliminate residual cancer tissue, but is in high spirits. I have had very little discomfort at all from the very beginning. I don't think I've taken a Tylenol since I had the surgery. MGH reports that dozens of other patients have had similar success stories with brain path surgery. I can't even tell you had surgery. Dustin Bonk, TV6 News, Marquette. Truly amazing.